I'm going to do a short video today on something that I learned the hard way and that is replacing the fuel sensor switch which is right here into the fuel block uh, on my CUCV. I ordered a brand new one from a seller on uh, eBay. Cats over here. And uh, <laughs> anyway didn't come with a fuel sensor switch but I had one. I wanted to show you that there's two different kinds of fuel blocks here and the numbers are different on the side. So here as you can see it fits right in the hole where it's supposed to go and on the new one it does not fit and I broke one of these trying to put it in. So if you uh, get one of these new fuel blocks and you want to put a new fuel sensor switch in you have two options here. One would be to remount this area here a little bit to allow this thing to slip in along with its o-ring or you can take this and make it smaller around the sides so that it'll slip in. Uh, it's pretty important that I post this because I, I'm sure there's going to be other people like myself that'll break these switches. They're getting expensive and hard to get so uh, Anyway, uh, this is going on Steel Soldiers. Hope it did you guys some good. I'm going to post pictures of the serial numbers or the part numbers of the fuel blocks also.